We are one step closer to opening the doors to the Thirsty Whippet pub, and this week we've been working on a project that's essential before we actually do that. So I'm going to show you where we've got to with that. We've also combined two of our favorite things and created a magical event that we hosted for the first time this week. And I'm going to take you behind the scenes so you can see all the details of what we did and how it worked. And today I am so excited because I am going to be revealing to you for the very first time our Manor Keys key ring. Now this is a key ring that is going to be personalized to all our key holders. It will only be available to key holders as part of our Manor Key um, community. And I'm going to show you what it looks like today for the very first time. So make sure you watch to the end of the video so you see that. And don't forget, if you're enjoying our videos, make sure you hit subscribe on our Lady Smith Manor Diaries YouTube channel and uh, to ensure that you see all our videos as soon as they come out. But first, let me show you what we've been up to this week. This morning, I am just finishing off our ornaments. Uh, we've had lots of orders for this year's ornament, which has got the... Uh, logo on one side and our nutcracker on the other side and uh, I'm just finishing putting the hanger piece on these ones so that I can pack them all up and they're ready for shipping and for pickup so thank you to everyone who ordered one um, I'm really looking forward to seeing them on your tree so if you ordered one uh, make sure you take a photo and send it to me because I'd love to see this year's ornament on uh, on your tree but uh, talking about ornaments I'm always so, so grateful when people give me gifts and it's it, it's just such a lovely part of what we do. And uh, this year I got three ornaments given to me um, and uh, I wanted to show you because they're so adorable. I got this one, Lynn gave me this nutcracker, which I just think is so sweet. Um, obviously very fitting for this year's uh, market. Um, but uh, all these ornaments, I actually find that a lot of these I actually keep up all year round in my office because they're just so adorable. So thank you, Lynn, for this really sweet, sweet ornament. Um, Marilyn also brought, uh, gave me an ornament uh, when she came to our Christmas tea. Uh, and this one is, if you know Marilyn, Marilyn loves hats and uh, she's the queen of hats. And so she gave me this really adorable little hat ornament, which I just love. So thank you so much, Marilyn. That one's gonna go on my tree and then uh, up in my office. Um, and then I also got an ornament from Emma. Now, if you've been following us, you'll remember, or you probably remember that Emma gives me an ornament every year. And I just love her for that. She And this year she didn't disappoint. She came at our Christmas market and she gave me this just adorable, I need to hold it up so you can see, this little ornament. And it's a ballerina holding a nutcracker. I've never seen one quite like it and I just love it. And the lovely thing about Emma is she always gives me an ornament that's totally uh, connected with our theme. So last year, um, or she's given me a night before Christmas ornament. She's given me a dicky, like they're just perfect. And the other thing she gave me was a pair of her ballet shoes. Now, if you remember in one of my previous um, videos, I was talking about the fact that if you've got ballet shoes or you know where to get them, I would love some because it's just perfect for the market uh, and my theme this year. And they've even got her name written on the bottom, which I just, just love. So a huge, oh, sorry about, <laughs> can you hear Jackson hacking in the back? Um, so a huge, huge thank you to Emma um, for her ballet shoes, which I just, just love. They're so precious. Um, and my ballerina and nutcracker ornament. And also to uh, Marilyn for my hat and Lynn for my nutcracker um, ornaments. I just love them. They're always so precious. And so I get a variety of different ones each year and they're always, I, I keep them all in a very safe place. And I just love looking back at them and, and remembering the stories and thinking of those that gave me. So thank you, thank you, thank you to those, uh, to those people that gave me uh, gifts this year. And these are not, I, I did get some other gifts as well. And if you gave me something, I just so appreciate it. Thank you so much. So I guess I better get these all wrapped up. I've got my uh, little bags here for pickup. I'm gonna put them into the paper bags so that everyone can come by and pick them up. And then uh, I've got a few that I've got to ship, so I'm gonna get those off as well. 
People often comment about the fact that I'm always moving furniture around in the manor and they're not wrong. Two weeks ago, the, the house looked like a Christmas market and last weekend we changed it to be something completely different. We combined two things we love, afternoon tea and Christmas and hosted our very first Christmas afternoon tea. Everyone is invited to choose their teacup for the afternoon and tables were set in the dining room the reception room and the music room with cakes, scones, freshly brewed tea, and of course, Christmas decorations. The question we get asked the most at the moment is when is the pub gonna open? And I promise you it is getting very, very close uh, because we are just working on a few final jobs. Uh, to allow us to get all the inspections signed off. And one of those is to get the uh, walls and the floor in our prep kitchen all finished so that the health inspector will sign us off. So this week we've been working on our little prep kitchen here by the pub. The walls are almost ready for drywall. We have our insulation now in, our uh, electrics are pretty much done, the plumbing is almost ready to go. Uh, so we are ready to bring in the drywall and get it on the walls. And then we will be then uh, tiling the floor. Uh, but we're getting very, very close to seeing this room looking more like a room. All we have to do now is take all this drywall and put it on the walls and the ceiling in the kitchen, ready for tile. It's one of those days where all you wanna do is cozy up and get warm. It's pretty cold out there. And so today I've come into the music room with my coffee. Jackson's joined me here and we're sitting in front of the fire because I wanted to share with you something very exciting. This is a first for us and I wanted you to be the first to know. Because if you remember a couple of weeks ago, I announced that we are, um, cre we've created our Manor Keys community. Now this is a community that gives you as a key holder, um, it allows you to unlock exclusive access, discounts, rewards, um, it gives you first access to tickets. It gives you the option, opportunity to book accommodation so you can stay in one of our suites. It will give you invitations to key holder only events. There are so many benefits. We even have a doggy door key, which allows you to get, um, allows your dog to get free beer and treats when they come to the pub. There is so much and there's a bit for everyone, whether you are, um, Somewhere on the other side of the world, we have um, an option for you. And if you're living local, more locally and you're going to be coming to the, the uh, Thirsty Whippet Pub in the Manor regularly, you get all sorts of discounts and benefits that way too. So we are so excited that we are going to be opening the doors on Friday the 8th of December. So the doors will be open for you to join and become a key holder for four weeks. It's gonna be open from the 8th to the 29th of December, then they, it will close. If you don't join in that time, you'll then have to wait till next year when we'll open it again. But in that time, you will have the opportunity to join us as a key holder. And as a key holder, you get something very special and very exclusive. You get your very own key ring. Now, these are key rings that we have just finished producing. They're gonna have our logo on it, but also your name, so they're gonna be personalized. And on the back of each key ring, there will be a personalized QR code that will um, allow you to scan your key ring when you come to the Thirsty Whippet Pub on the Manor. And that will then tell our system who you are, what your um, access is as a key holder, and give you all your discounts. So your discounts on the boutique, on food and drink at the Thirsty Whippet Pub, all the different um, benefits and rewards that you get will be automatic automatically entered into our system every time you scan so you'll be rewarded each time you come. So we are so excited about this. This is my one. Obviously, you can see it's got my name on. Um, I haven't got my QR code yet on the, on the back, but I'll have to put mine on. But like I say, each key holder when you join, will we will um, issue one of these for you with your name. It will be sent to you. Um, each year, you will get also get your annual 
goodie box, which will be filled with Lady Smith Manor and Thirsty Whippet goodies as well. Um, and so there's lots of benefits. So as I said, the uh, key holder doors will be opening on Friday the 8th. So in the next week, you will start to see lots more information on our Facebook and Instagram post. I will be sending out information in our email each week. So you will have the opportunity to join us as part of our Lady Smith community, get all sorts of members only content. I'll be doing lots more videos. We'll be doing live questions and answers with myself and Stephen. You'll even get opportunities, uh, members only opportunities that you can actually come and um, do exclusive events with me and Stephen here at the Manor. So there'll be lots of exciting things for you to join. But like I say, our key ring is coming um, and I, we're already starting to produce these ready for all our key holders when they join up. Uh, but I wanted you to be the first to see this because I'm quite excited about uh, having these and uh, being able to meet and, and see all our key holders when they come to the manor. But uh, I am going to get back to work because like I say, we have lots to do. I'm just putting the final touches into the members portal that will be um, available for all our key holders when they join. And uh, like I say, lots more videos, lots more content, all sorts of discounts will be coming your way if you decide to join us as a key holder. So um, watch your email and the uh, information on Facebook and Instagram and uh, so that you see all the information and you'll have seen my camera just jump. That was Hendrix. He's laying right by my camera tripod and he's just knocked it. So uh, apologies for that. But I'm going to get back to work. I'm going to finish my coffee and uh, I will see you back here next week for our next episode of the Lady Smith Manor Diaries. <laughs>